Welcome to this BR143 electric locomotive in DB traffic red livery. During this brief introduction, we will go through the start and stop procedures. Climb aboard to get started. The battery will power up the control desk and allow you to interact with it. This locomotive draws power from the overhead electrical supply via a pantograph mounted on the roof. For this to work, we'll need to set up which configuration we'll be using. A lot of your time will be spent in the driver's seat. To get the locomotive up and running, set the master switch. Headlights are important in letting others around know that a locomotive is operational. We now need to wait a moment and let the brake system charge. It'll take a minute or two. The locomotive is now ready to be energized. This is controlled by the main circuit breaker. The train brake is used for normal line operations. When stopped for longer periods of time or when leaving the cab, a handbrake is engaged. We'll need to ensure this is released in order to get moving. The force selector determines how much tractive effort force is being supplied to the train. AFB allows the driver to easily amend the speed of a locomotive as required. Once a desired speed is set, indicated by a red needle on the speedometer, the locomotive will automatically adjust to meet that speed. To prepare the train for stopping, AFB should first be turned off. The size and weight of a train play a large part in determining how much braking force is needed to perform a safe, steady stop. Good work, that is the basics covered. A manual can also be obtained that provides more detail about the full functionality of this locomotive.